Hello and welcome to the video guys, hope everyone is doing good. Today I have brought you an upper body workout that I did yesterday. This is basically a low volume deload workout that I felt like doing and I'm gonna be going through every exercise I did in here. So if you guys are new to the channel, my main focus is to show you guys that you can train pretty much anywhere you want. You don't particularly need a gym to get fit and muscular. I would simply recommend everyone who's watching my videos to get a pair of gymnastic rings. That is all you need. I have found out about them this last year and I've been training with them ever since. I love this equipment guys. Not only does it provide me with really really intense workouts, but they're very very fun to train with. So without further ado, let's get on to the workout. First up boys, we're doing some L-sit chin-ups to work on my back and biceps. Now the reason why I'm doing the L-sit throughout my reps is to make the movement more challenging basically. Because currently I can do more than 15 normal chin-ups. So simply by doing an L-sit I am changing my leverages hence making the exercise a lot more difficult. So if you guys didn't know, this is how you progress difficulty without weights. By pretty much just changing your leverages. Next up, we're doing one of my favorite push-up variations for sure. This is called the ring turned out push-up. Now I'm sure most of you guys know that this exercise works on your chest, shoulders and triceps, but you guys actually might not know this. Now this exercise also works on your upper chest a lot because we're pushing with our hands rotated the entire time. So if you guys want to develop a complete chest, definitely add this to your routine. Next up, I'm doing some L-sit holds on the rings for that next level core activation. Now it's time to work on our back thickness and to do that I'm using one of my favorite variations to hit my back, the advanced duck lever row. Now if you guys find this movement to be too difficult at first, work on uh, normal ring rows on the ground. It will work the same muscles but it will be a little bit easier if you guys are new to the rings. And with time you guys can do some tuck lever rows to totally defy gravity. Now after the rows I decided to work on my front lever holds a little bit. Now because my back was totally fried after the rows, I decided to drop the difficulty a little bit and do some advanced duck lever holds for as much time as I can. This may look very easy but trust me guys, it's actually quite challenging, especially after a very heavy bullying exercise.
So that is it for the video guys, if you guys enjoyed this little workout, make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Make sure to ask me anything in the comment section and I will do my best to answer. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.